All right, so here is the Chulux Coffee Brewer. I've actually already used this. I took it on vacation with me. I was going on a little trip uh, in between the lakes. I wanted to have a coffee maker there. I didn't know if they'd have one and I need my coffee. So I looked on Amazon and at the time, this is the most inexpensive coffee maker on Amazon, or K cup one. So I figured let's give it a shot and I did. And I really liked it. I mean, you can use it anywhere really. And a small, Molly's a teacher. She might use it in her classroom, but it's very simple. So I plugged it in, you undo this. And the whole top comes up, you can see right there, it's where I used it. That's just dirty coffee grounds in it. And then there's a little water reservoir here. So my only complaint would be, there's not really a measurement system there to the water. It's just like a hole that you pour water into. So I'll show you, we'll put a cup in here. It does have this little drip tray. So essentially we had a bigger cup, like I put a travel size mug, it fits there. And then there is this little guy to catch the water. So let's use this. And then again, the only complaint is you don't know how much water you're really supposed to put in there. Like that's probably way more than it would possibly need, but there's not really a measurement system there. There's not like a little gauge on the side to let you know how much water. I mean, ideally you could put water in there and then just keep using it throughout the day, but it's not really a clear idea. So, so now the light's blue, so I pressed it once. So the light was not on. Press it once, it flashes blue. And then now we're gonna make ourselves some coffee. I will say, I use this on vacation every day. It was perfectly fine. Due to the smaller footprint, my theory is it's slower because it's a smaller device and it takes longer to heat up. But the coffee was fine. I mean, it was K-Cups, so I don't mind K-Cups. I think they're perfectly fine. But it did take longer, I think, than a normal Keurig, or at least the other Keurigs I've had before. But again, it's a fraction of the price, at least my purchases of what it was. Amazon does change prices frequently, but it was a fraction of the price when I purchased it. And again, for what it was worth, it was small, easy to transport. I put it in my Jeep at the time and moved it on. Worked out just great. See, there's another problem. It just pours out as much water as you put in there. So basically when I was on vacation, I would just fill up the cup that I was gonna use and then dump that in there. And then, but then if you wanna make a second cup of coffee, you gotta rinse and clean the cup out, you know, so it's, it's kind of a pain, so. All right, and I do have a little temperature gun here. And let's go ahead and 172 degrees is what I'm showing here. So, I mean, it's putting out a pretty decent hot cup of coffee. Again, I actually purchased this for myself. No one sent it to me. A lot of times people send me stuff. This one I bought myself, used it myself, and it gets the, the big thumbs up for me, buddy. So, all right, thanks. Yeah.